Do you guys want a Yahoo? Please. It was sent in by Emily Wall. Thanks, Emily. It's by Yahoo Answers user Lunar Cure, who asks, Farmers have seen some awesome secrets of nature. Tell us some, please. <laughs> like sunflowers, bee dances, etc. <laughs> I'm sorry, what was that second one? Bee dances. <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh, somewhere a, a farmer just smiles knowingly and, and sh- slowly shakes his head. These secrets go to my grave, kids. I went to a, uh, a murder mystery a few weeks ago at a castle in Ohio. True story. And not a, not a goof story. set up. Not a goof yet. We're not at the goof. There is no goof here. There's just truth. And while I was there, there was a man dressed up like a, some sort of battle monk. And he had a, a wife who was a nun. And they performed for us a dance that they learned from the owls behind their house to the tune of Thriller. (gasps) I have a video on my phone. If you ever catch me in real life, you say, Justin, I got to see that owl dance. And I will hook you up. Why? Were the owls like, all right, from the top. I don't want to see. We've been working on this for a while. I, I want to see some snap. Don't make it lazy. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Jazz feathers. Um, bee dances are apparently they a real. Don't have hands. F- sure, thank you, Travis. I think bee okay. dances are a real thing. It's called Is a like it's called a waggle dance, which describes literally every dance I'm also capable of doing. <laughs> 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 Yahoo answer once it responded, "Flowers are plant genitalia." <laughs> secret exposed secret <laughs> secret revealed farmers probably know some shit though they probably know some fucking earth wisdom they're probably well not these days these days farmers just flip the switch on the machine that yanks the milk out of the cow's tits do you think do you think that farmers still know how high the sycamore grows i don't think no <laughs> No, I think the only well, the only, why does the grinning bobcat grin? They don't care about why the bear <coughs> bobcat grins. They just want to shower him in chemicals. You know, Can I paint think, with all the colors of the mountain. Listen, Douglas, I think your farm is great. I do think that if you did not have that giant sycamore in the middle of it, just to see how tall it'll grow. Um, why if I, I cut it down? I'll never know. <laughs> you won't live to see it. No one will. My children's uh, you, children will. Their children's children are going to turn it into magazines. Man, that bobcat sure seems to like it, though. <laughs> that bobcat seems pleased as punch. How did he do that? I don't know. He's just that way. That's just how he is. Call him Henry. <laughs> Everything is shale colored. Yeah, dog, it's mountain colors, idiot. <laughs> Pay with the color of the mountain. That's what I do. Um, apparently, sunflowers fucking rotate to follow the sun across the sky. Yeah. It's called heliotropism. Didn't know this. I just learned about heliotropism from Yahoo Answers. Is it real? I don't want you to learn from Yahoo Answers. Griffin, Answers you just ever. yearn. That, this is the singularity. Everybody out. I don't want to learn anything from Yahoo Answers either, but if it happens, then I'm willing to accept it because I love knowledge and I love drinking it up. And apparently, heliotropism is, is the thing. Apparently, it Waggle Dance. Wikipedia is telling me all about Waggle Dances now. I'm going down a fucking <laughs> rabbit hole right now. Griffin to knowledge is like a sunflower to the sun. Mm-hmm. Griffin just tilts I his... I tilt my little head towards his, it. Uh, his genitalia. I tilt my plant Griffin genitalia to- towards... <laughs> uh, one of the Yahoo answers responded, Carrots! <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. Revealed. I bet you guys I, uh, cows know... I bet you <laughs> cows also know some shit, but mostly farmers know, know some shit about Earth and the way things work that they're not telling us. About good dirt and bad dirt. Uh, I bet that's something they know, about, they know a lot that. about. I bet you they... know what's funny is they know a lot about farming, but they've never seen like a tall building or like a car. Yeah, like, right. They would like, be horrified. Mailbox. It would be very scary. There's a. Uh, I've been trying to get into gardening. Sydney and I have been trying to plan some stuff. And uh, speaking of secrets that farmers know, one of those secrets that I don't know that I'm betting farmers do is. Basically not knowing what plants will emerge from the ground and which I will have to retrieve from there. Mm-hmm. I literally had to ask Sydney about basically every plant. Like, will the will the pepper be 
in the ground or will it be above the ground? Oh. And I bet that's a secret that farmers have on lock pretty much. Yeah, I bet that that's pretty important to just their general survival and their fiscal stability is just knowing sort of like where the carrots are at any given I can time. Never remember. Ah, oh, shit! I did it wrong again. I <laughs> dug up. Is it a plant. is ah. it a carrot tree? Fuck! I can't remember. I did it bad. I am the worst farmer. I don't know any of the secrets of Mother Earth's beautiful womb that I grow my carrot children inside. I should never cut down that sycamore. Uh, one of my f- neighbor farmers told me that if you feed a cow rocks, then he'll he'll poop out whole watermelons that you can sell at the country fair, uh, but they just killed them. I, they died. They're tricky farmers. That's the secret about farm wisdom. Mm-hmm. Is you you they're either telling you something that will enrich your life, like heliotropism and bee dances, or they'll give you a little riddle. They'll play mm-hmm. a trick. They'll play a trick on you. They're like bridge trolls. They're actually descended from bridge trolls. <laughs> they are. All farmers are descended from bridge trolls. They only speak in riddles. Mm-hmm. Yep. There's another secret for you. You know that that poem God made a farmer. Mm-hmm. It's not true. God made a bridge troll, and then they. Just sort of naturally fell into and they, another. Vacation. They defied his teachings <laughs> they, they, and they left the bridges, mm-hmm. and so they were cast out of Eden. Mm-hmm. That's Genesis one one, baby. Read a book. Read a book specifically the Bible, specifically our new version of the Bible. <laughs> the Brothers <laughs> Grimm presents the Bible. <laughs> I want to ask a real question and help someone okay. to. Undo if you know farm wisdom, will you email? If you live on a farm, first of all, that's dope that you're listening to a podcast on a farm. Second of You've all, done it. email us some farm wisdom because I'm genuinely interested in farm wisdom now. And a picture. Can I have a picture of a cow, please? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Send us a telegram or something. I mean, they're farmers. They don't have internet. They're getting this podcast delivered on a on a uh, a jump drive. <laughs> the mail. The, the milkman swings by every day. I'm not sure why they would need a milkman because. Live on a farm. He's picking probably, up. Probably. He's picking up. Oh, Brooklyn. I see what I, I see. I get you. <laughs> I see what I did. They got to get it from somewhere, I guess. Yeah. Cow tits. <laughs> <laughs>